Hey guys, uh, that's me again, and today I'm gonna show you how to make the annoying orange effect uh, on Adobe After Effects. Uh, first step, the uh, of course you'll need a picture of the orange, and second of all, you'll need to have a picture of someone talking, as shown. Um, well, he doesn't need to be extra stable. Um, it's okay if he moves a bit, but not so much. Um, so our 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 first step is first of all, I just named them. I'll name this um, orange footage, and I'll name the picture the orange picture here uh, orange. Once I name them, I'll drag the orange footage and uh, insert it to a new comb. Then I'll get rid of it and I'll just delete it. Then I'll insert the orange in the in here. Once I uh, made it like that, um, I will just uh, um, drag the orange footage again to a new comb. In here, actually, we're gonna uh, stable the eyes and the mouth. Wait, uh, let's go here. Once um, I'll just name this orange final. Sorry, guys, I forgot to say that. Okay. So here, uh, here we're gonna stable the um, the eyes and the mouth. So first of all, you need to click Windows and click on Tracker if you don't have it and um, once you clicked on the tracker, I already have it. Uh, click on stabilize motion, then zoom in, and I'll just drag it up a bit. Okay, now that's good. I'll drag this box uh, here right to the eyes, and I'll click on rotation, and I'll drag this right here. Okay, that's amazing. Okay. Once I finish this, I'll click on Analyze Forward. Uh, what actually happens here is that the um, uh, it, uh, it, it stabilized and it analyzed the uh, eyes uh, motion. I mean, eyes uh, movements. And okay, um, I have this for 30 seconds. I'll be back when it's finished. So, right. Okay, guys, ten seconds remaining. Um, uh, everything should be okay. Like the, if uh, this box uh, went up or down, it's gonna be a very uh, big problem because it's gonna flip and stuff. I'll be right back in five. I mean, in yeah, five seconds. Okay, now I'm almost done. Um, I'll just. When it reaches 30 seconds, I'll just stop it. Okay, um, right there. Okay. Once uh, we finished, you will uh, analyze that there's some boxes, and these are actually to analyze your um, motions. I mean your uh, movements. <laughs> okay. Now, once we finish this, I want you to click on apply. And we want it uh, to be in X and Y. Once um, we click on Apply, we're gonna click on OK, and um, then click here on RAM Preview. It should all be uh, previewed. It may take some time, and sometimes it might not finish. And I think here it will not finish, but it's okay. Okay, that it just reached to here. I don't know why. Um, because I think because I bought the laptop new and okay. As you can see, that the eyes and the mouth are stable. And everything uh, else is moving, all except the eyes and the mouth.
Okay, um, that's just a video, and I'm gonna be posting soon. Um, well, once we finish this, I'll just name this. I'll name this orange table. Oh, so, okay. Once I name this orange table, I'll just drag it to a new comb, and I'll name that comb orange uh, map. Okay, now I'll cl uh, click on the orange table here, and I'll click on my keyboard Control D three times. So I have three copies of the um, orange table. Okay, actually I need the three layers. The first one will be to the left eye, and the second one will be to the right eye, and the third one is gonna be for the mouth. Okay, so. I'll just name that left eye and I'll name that um, right eye and I'll name that uh, mouth. Okay. Once I name them, I will click on the oh sorry. Um, I'll click on the left eye. Then I will solo. I'll just click here and I'll zoom in and I'll just drag it to the eyes now what I'm gonna actually do is I am gonna make a mask so I'll just click on the pen tool and I'll make that mask okay that's perfect now uh, remove the solo mark and click on the right eye and move it to the right eye and click the pen to I mean first of all you should solo again and click on the pen tool and make the same what I did there oh wait okay that's uh, good now click on the mouse and remove that solo and click solo again um, now I'll move that down to the mouse and I'll just um, do the same wait oh, okay um, that's good now what I'm gonna do is um, I'll click on all of the solos okay I'll zoom out and as you can see everything went except the eyes and the mouth now um, we're gonna click on first of all I'll just um, like the annoying orange uses only one eye so I'll just delete the right eye and click on the left eye and uh, I'll just copy it and paste it and I will name that layer uh, right eye and I'll just move that here so it can be more um, uh, fancy and fa I mean fantasy okay I'll just move the eyes like that they should be a bit far then I'll uh, make the mouse smaller wait okay and it should be here the mouse should be smaller than the eye okay that's good once we finish that just um, uh, highlight all of the layers and um, click on your keyboard M and F so you can do the feather now click here and I'll just make it uh, 20 or yeah it's good and here 20 and here I'll make it 31 okay as you can see now it looks like that so these can be colored okay once we finish this I'll double click on the orange final 
and I'll drag the orange mask on the up layer of the orange as you can see now it's like that you can just move it um, click S on your keyboard to arrange the scale make it uh, bigger or smaller just make it like that okay um, and I'll make it on the right a bit just, okay that's good once you finished making that uh, click on effect then click on color correction and on hue saturation now adjust this to the orange color as you can see now it's purple and here it's blue and whatever I'll just make it uh, I'll just search for the orange color wait okay and that with that pointer is going up to the orange so that's good now I'll click on colorize and I will adjust these first of all just make it that 100 then I'll start uh, making them see now I'll find more color okay, that's orange but I will not I don't need it that much okay um like this is good but wait um okay that's amazing I'll just drag this a bit here okay once I finish this I'll just um uh, if you want you can click on effect and go to color correction and play with these and play with the curves for example just make it like that and go to green and make it mix it okay um, now uh, once we finish we're gonna go to um, wait effects again and color correction you just can play with these okay now we're done um, you can just um, you can just uh, render and um, whatever you can do. Okay, that's all, and that's how to do an annoying orange video. I'll just, well, um, first of all, you just need to click here, and that's all. As you can see, we've made the you have made your own annoying orange video, and the eyes are stable, and the mouth is stable, and everything is analyzed. Okay. Don't forget to watch that video soon. Okay, that's all. Bye bye.